no planters in here, but I did get those two candlesticks. It was only a total of five bucks. So I am now headed to at home, my intention in the first place. I also thought this was a different Goodwill. <laughs> I've been to this one before, but there's a couple in the city. So when I walked in, I was a little bit confused because I thought it was the other one. I'm gonna check where that one is. I might go to another one, but first let's go to at home. That was a little bit of a fail in terms of trying to find a planter. I did get a couple other things that I needed. No planter because usually going up and down those planter aisles, it's completely stocked. And then I kind of forgot that it was winter because planters are usually a seasonal item. And because here in Arizona, it doesn't get that cold. I kind of forget that sometimes. I'm going to have to come back when it is springtime because I think I'm going to have a whole lot more options. I am going to go to another Goodwill. I don't know why I feel like going to all these different places. I usually drag my husband along with me, but yeah, we're going to go to Goodwill next. Okay, so actually another quick pit stop. because Turn left. Then turn right. Another quick pit stop because I'm starving. So before I go to Goodwill, the second Goodwill, I'm gonna stop by Target because it's right here. Everything is just lining up. So I'm gonna grab a protein bar. I was gonna get just one box of Power Crunch bars. These are my favorite, the salted caramel ones. And it's only $6 there. I usually spend like $12 because my grocery store, that's how much I sell them for. It's ridiculous. I bought three of these. And then my husband and I, we like Olipop. So this is watermelon lime. Never tried this one. So let's see how this tastes. A little taste test. And that's all I got. I don't taste that much watermelon. Yeah, it's mostly lime. Not bad though. Okay, final location is the second Goodwill. Let's see if I find anything. I think I see a girl walking. Oh, um, I just realized I don't actually know where the Goodwill is. Why did I not put the GPS on? not find anything in this goodwill also how many goodwills are in this area before getting to this one i thought i've been to this one already and i haven't this is not the one i went to last time i'm gonna show you what i got when i got home and i didn't even eat the protein bar that i went to target for because i'm gonna eat a real meal when i get home oh shoot i should have i ended up getting these two this was at the first goodwill that i went to 249 each and there's some crap on it. I don't know what it is. Ew, it's like some gunk. Gross. Brown goopy thing. Oh, maybe it's candle. Okay, I'm gonna hope they had a brown goopy candle. I feel like that color's not common for a candle though. Okay, so those two have been polished. So they're kind of beat up, but that's fine. Gives it some character. I'm gonna show you the other stuff i got for them i got this at at home and it's a set of four tapered unscented candles they were 10 inches neutral color of course i was contemplating on getting the green one that i showed in the store but i don't know i think that's a little bit too christmasy this is like a good everyday one cute i think i'm gonna put this over by the dining table Dining table or entryway? Or on the shelf. I'm not really sure. 
It's perfect. Okay, I'm gonna go put them over. Mm. I'm moving them. I don't like it. I've been walking around the house with the two candlesticks and putting it in random places, and I think I like it the best right here. And I like it in this corner because there was nothing over here besides this and that. So that's where it's gonna go. The other thing I got from at home was this Pyrex container. And I needed another one because this one's a little bit deeper. Literally says 50% deeper there. And this is perfect for baking. So not only baking stuff in, but also when I bake something and bring it to someone's house, which is quite often, anytime someone invites us over, I bake something to bring over. And I opened it. Okay, there you go. This would be perfect for when I bake cupcakes. I could just stick it directly in here and then the top frosting wouldn't get ruined by the cover since it's deeper. And also recently for New Year's, I had my in-laws come and then I made some tiramisu, but I had to leave it in the container I baked it in, which is a lot wider. And it took up so much room in the fridge. So this would be perfect. I pretty much have shown you everything that I bought today, but I wanted to share this because this is quite new as well. Isn't this adorable? This is reusable paper towels. So I got this from Etsy and I can link the shop down below. It snaps together. I think it's made of 100% cotton. I, I threw it in the washing machine. It washed well. I definitely still use paper towels. Like if I'm cleaning certain things, like the thing I just brought home from Goodwill, I'm definitely gonna use a paper towel, but this is to reduce the use of paper towels. And I also have like other, this is my flower sack rag drawer. We also use these. I just wanted to share, I thought this was cute. Oh, look, it's lazy. Oh, really? Come on. Go. Please. Go. Go. Thank you. I'm heating up some sinigang right now that my father-in-law made when he was here. And I'm also having some Pringles. These aren't ordinary Pringles, they're scallop Pringles. Scallop flavored Pringles. It's from Japan. A Japanese store recently opened. Uh, it's called Tesso Life and they have so many cool snacks. Mm. Sitting down right here. Sitting with some rice. This was one of the Christmas gifts that my sister got for me. It was the perfect thing because I get a new planner every year because I like to do my to-do lists. This was yesterday. This is today. Other than that, just relaxing with the babies. This is from my husband's aunt. She gave them a giant dog bed and they love it. Anytime you pet one, you gotta pet the other. I'm just gonna relax with the baby. As my husband comes home later, we're probably gonna watch the Suns game. And have a chill Friday night. It's 3.30 right now. I feel like I've done so much today when I really haven't. Okay.